make sure to include exercise in your life to stay healthy, but did you know that it's also just as important to exercise the muscles in your brain? Yeah, <laughs> to make sure we all stay health smart, tonight we introduce you to an exercise that some believe can help with the onset of Alzheimer's disease. KTLA's Lou Parker here to explain. Hi, Lou. Hey, guys. Well, you can sort of consider it like gymnastics for the brain a uh -huh. little bit. And when we think about it, they mention Alzheimer's. It is a disease that affects your memory, but did you know also that it is now the sixth leading cause of death in America. The good news is maybe we can change that. The meditation is based on a 5,000 year old yoga technique. And according to Dr. Dharma Singh Khalsa, if you practice it only 12 minutes a day, it can help control the onset of Alzheimer's. Plus, it's scientifically proven to do more. We've also seen studies where we've shown reversal of memory loss, improvement in mood, in energy, in happiness. The singing exercise called Kirtan Kriya is pretty simple. You chant while touching your fingers together. The chant partly out loud, then a whisper, then silent. The way to do it is alternating the fingers, pressing the thumb to the index, middle finger, ring finger, and the small finger. We use speech by singing and touching our fingers at the same time. We're sending a very powerful message of energy and blood flow to critically important areas in the brain. Medical research conducted by various leading medical schools, including UCLA, has shown when a person practices this ancient exercise, the same areas of the brain light up as affected by Alzheimer's. And while it is by no means a cure, Dr. Kalsa tells KTLA anyone at any age or stage of life should consider using the memory exercise as a possible prevention. I go to the gym, I lift weights, I build up my biceps, for example. Well, you can do this as a mental gym and build up those muscles or those areas in your brain that are so important to keep strong so you don't lose your memory as you age. Now, the doctor says that you don't really have to be familiar with yoga to do this exercise. You can even practice it sitting in a chair, really, in any clothing. You notice I had just my pink blouse and, and black pants on. To read more about the research and to see a video on how you can do this at your home, this exercise, you can always go to KTLA.com. Of course, I knew no, you guys were going to do it. Big red info button. I have to be honest. I kind of got giggly and a little euphoria after doing this, and I didn't even do it in full. Where no? was the camera for that? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> exactly. oh, that's true. That's a great point. <laughs> we'll practice it daily. Thank you Thank so you. much, Lou. Okay, see you tomorrow.